here we are picking up our bolt. It's a horrible day for it. It's raining ice and it's windy. And they've got this car all spick and span and nice and shiny and I'm about to ruin that. Oh look, it includes a free wife. Hey everybody, big day at Driven to Bolt. Actually, first day at Driven to Bolt. And here's our bolt, fresh from the dealer. Today was very blustery and uh, it was raining uh, ice and uh, stuff. So we got it a little wet, but it's all shiny. And then I just completed the installation of that charging unit you see there. Here's the charging unit. It's plugged into a 14-50 uh, uh, 50 amp outlet. And there is the business end. So now I need to actually turn on the circuit breaker, see if this thing blows up the garage. Okay, here's the breaker panel. Okay, we've got 50 amp plug east and 50 amp plug weast. This one is on the east as opposed to weast. So we'll turn on the east breaker. Okay, here goes some here goes something. Ah, ah, nothing exploded. Let's go see if we have lights over at our charger. Our charger is alive. All right. I guess what we have to do next is uh, plug it into the car and push that button. Or should we push the button and then plug it into the car? Tell you what, let's push that button and see if the LCD lights up. And then maybe we'll push the button again to turn it off before we plug it into the car. Let's see here. Power. What's that say? 238 volts. That's good. 57 degrees Fahrenheit. 32 amps. So it's getting full amperage. That is good news. Let's see if we can get a readout on that. Okay, I think what I'm going to do then is turn that off and then plug into the car. Okay, there's our opening for the car. So the first time pushing this. Whew. There we go. Okay, so it's got your regular level two port here and then there's this extra port for the DC fast charging so when you're charging at a uh, kind of supercharger level station I guess level three they would call that um, with the um, level two like we have here in the garage we can get they say 20 to 25 miles per hour added and then with the when you add the DC fast charging, you can get up to 100 miles in an hour. So 25 miles an hour is great for home uh, because you'll charge overnight. But when you're on the road and trying to drive more than 200 miles in a day, uh, you're gonna want a uh, fast charger, so you're only spending an hour um, waiting to get another 100 miles of range. All right, let's go ahead and give this a whirl. Here's the business end of this thing. Got a little hooky thing on the end. 
And I guess I kind of just hook this in. Oh, there's a little lever you pull. I'll pull that. Plugged in. Has anything happened on the dash? Not yet. Okay. So. Okay, here's the moment of truth. We're going to turn this thing on. Car made a little beep. Nice. Okay. So that looks like it's working. See what the car says. Oh, it's locked. There we go. There we go. Charging, charging, jing, jing. Okay, it appears to have shut itself off. I assume it is still charging. Looks like it is over there. Yep. So uh, we'll let it do its thing and uh, check it when it's done. Mm-hmm. <laughs>